Hello and we're playing Saul today on Scuttleboat Scuffle and we got an awesome Hercules partner here. His name is Oh I'm Done. I love that name. And we got a Ymir and another Hercules. I actually like their names too. Ymir himself is playing up with the beautiful name Josephia Dufin. And then we got the Hercules on the Stony Dolph. Now as you can see here, I am playing Saul, the mighty Fire Queen herself, going up against the Fire King, Ymir. Now what I love about this matchup right now is that I haven't played Saul in a long time. But the last time I played Saul, I was just spamming her for days. I feel like I'm still engaged with her to the point where I think I'm... Oh, I love the GG right there. Oh, they eliminated. Oh, I'm done already. All right, let me see if I can get him out here. He dodges out of my ultimate ability. I got to pull off this 1v2. Hold my last thought. Let me just focus on this commentary right here. I do get a nice explosion off on the Ymir right there. I'm hopping around, as you can see, waiting for cooldowns to come up. I wasn't expecting the Hercules to really do much. I think I collected the Ymir there with my little fireball. And yeah, yes, I did. Oh, I don't really got much. And thankfully, I did not get knocked out. Trying to save it right there. Going to use my fire fart. Come down here in a little bit. And boom! Oh, he dodged out. Got some light attacks before he could freeze me. And I did do a heavy, but it wasn't enough to knock him out. Hopefully, I could get the health orb. I wasn't sure if that would have let... Oh, no, no, no. I missed my ultimate there. Going to use my fire fart again. I oh, the Hercules has his ultimate. I'm kind of getting a little sketch right here. Going to jump out to dodge that. Oh, no. No, no, no. Oh, the Hercules came in with his... Oh, his boulder and knocked me out. I was hoping I would have survived. So what I basically would have done with Kiter until that came in, I tried to knock him out because they were getting very high on vulnerability. I think I was doing a very nice job 1v2ing the two coming behind there into the air light. Air heavy, hitting them both back into some light attacks there. Going to get the explosion. No, it gets canceled. I got a little worried. When I saw the little Wi-Fi on the right-hand corner of the screen, it really made me go, oh no, I don't want to disconnect. It already started off so good. But today has been very great for server-wise, at least for me. Oh no, I'm going to get frozen. But as I was saying, it's been very good server-wise for me. That Hercules is up there. Okay, I was going to try to come and collect him into an air combo and knock him out. But it didn't work. Backing up there, he used his belly slam. And I did counter him here. He dodged out. Gonna oh, I dodged at the wrong moment. Going to pop my alt here. Come down on him. Boom, nothing. That's okay. Oh. The fireball actually missed fire, Ymir, just by a little bit. I love the little GG. You saw the boulder right there. What's the Hercules doing? Can I get him right here? Boom. Turn around, slap. Nice. Perfect combo on my part. My Hercules partner is doing very good trying to knock them. They're both very high. Can I get the explosion off? Ooh. A near instant double kill from the Altman team duo right here. Muscle fire. It's great. I'm feeling it. Now, if you're wondering why I'm staying in the sky for so long, I'm looking for opportunities to either land my fireball or my fire fart. Something, you know, that would allow us to get an advantage over our opponents early. Going to interrupt the Umemir, drop him back. Oh, perfect boulder from my partner right there. I missed. I misjudged that range. I was hoping to interrupt the Hercules before he got a chance to do that. We're doing some nice damage on them, and somehow my partner is doing a fantastic job with that level 20 skin right there. He's pouncing. He's playing Hercules how I would love to play. Oh, this isn't going to look too good. I mean, obviously, I wasn't going to get knocked. Oh, perfect right here. Come in reversal, but I wasn't going to get knocked out at that moment. I had low vulnerability. That was a nice reversal, and my partner came in for the perfect counter play right there and eliminated the Ymir. I wonder if I could get the ultimate off right here. Boom! And it does eject him into the opposite direction. Oh man, I, I feel so hyped for that. I feel the spirit bomb. The universe gave me that power and we did it, guys. We saved Earth. But that that's a really weird angle for his wall to pop off on. Let's see if we could come out here. Victorious dodging back. Nice light attacks, but he also dodged. He did come back in a little too early, which allowed me to land some light attacks on him. It's pure chaos this match. This is one of the best matches. I've had probably, I would say, for the whole week so far. I know right now it's being recorded on a Tuesday, but it's one of the best matches I've done for the last two days of the week, mainly because it's just so much constant action. Saved my little buddy over there. Ooh, wait, wait, wait. Ooh. Okay, Dispersion was gladly up at the right time because I messed up there. I could have eliminated myself for all I knew. Coming in. Oh, I was trying to. Going to have to pop my ultimate here in a bit after I get him there with the fireball and the fire fart. Coming up to the ultimate to dodge. Missing it out. Going to dodge back and looking for an opportunity right here. Boom. Oh, I misjudged that really bad. She knocks me, but look at Hercules dropping the ultimate. Can't. Oh, he interrupts the other Hercules ultimate to slam him down and eliminate him. Let me see. Can I help the limb? Oh, no. I came in with the fire fart at the wrong moment. I talked too soon. I didn't even get a chance to save my buddy Hercules right there. I don't have any cooldowns up. So I'm just buying time right now. Dodging out. Staying a little bit far. It looked like Ymir did get collected with the boulder. 
That shoulder tackle was actually really sweet. It should have eliminated the mirror, but somehow he survived. He's in his giant fireball. I gotta get up here quickly. No, 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 he catches me out. As you can see, I put the emote immediately. I knew that was game over for me. And I love how he has the Olympian Hercules banner, just like, hey guys, I'm, I'm muscles. Okay, so can my partner do it or is Ymir? That was some nice dodges on both of their parts right there. He's probably going to try to collect them here. The icicle pops him off and he has a speed bonus. He needs to be very careful because if he gets frozen once, that could be it. He misses it and gets connected with a nice heavy attack by Ymir eliminating him out. I love the GG right there. The end two, two points. We're tied up. Who's going to come out victorious? Either way, I'm super happy. That was actually a bad fireball on my part. I can't believe I just did that. Coming in. Oh, okay. I was hoping he would have ended the charge, which would have allowed me right there to come in with the air light. But I still catch it off right there. Dodging out to avoid that. Nice side attacks to get some damage up on him. Oh, can I? I misjudged that. I was not going to say, can I save my partner? It didn't look like it, guys. Ooh, I was able to reverse that very nicely onto the Hercules, which means I didn't mess up. I did get hit. Thankfully, he's not using the ability that allows you to get slow. This should be the elimination on the Hercules. Now it's just a simple 1v2. However, to be fair, I thought that with the last run, as you can clearly see, Ymir was able to turn that around and bring his team a victory. He uses ice skill, that's down. What I'm looking to do is wait for him to make a mistake, and then I'm going to go in with my ultimate and probably get him out. Okay, perfect. Right here. He's coming in for the snow, and boom! Elimination. GG. That was one of the best matches of the week for me personally and we're going into another game right here we're on swinging spire with penny the pendulum as you saw in my map guide penny the pendulum has gotten more ko's than any player in divine knockout currently we're going up here against a thanatos and an izanami the death row duo and on my team we also have an izanami and it's always welcome right now so the goal is to try to eliminate these two as easy as possible. That would have been a very nice combo. We're going to come in here and probably try to use a hold heavy attack. And it does giving us the first round elimination. That makes me feel really good right now. I actually dodged back in the wrong area. One of the things I've learned about going against is an army. Wait, hold up. Can I get another hold heavy here? Roll, boom. Oh, the sight at the perfect moment and the dodge i love it gonna use this person here come close enough into the air light air heavy combo knocking her out that was actually a nicely timed scythe if it was a little later i probably would have been able to get her the same way i got the thanatos now who's gonna come in hit me throwing the fireball again on the thanatos timmy b right here I made a mistake, but I used my dispersion to counter it, knocking him out. I'm going to try my best to edge guard him. Also, my Saul guide is coming out very soon. It's one of the things I've been working on for a little while because Saul is one of those characters, in my personal opinion, that is super strong. She is able to counter everybody in the game. It's just she takes a lot of know-how. Okay, and as you can see here, we got an eliminated ally. I need to try to do a 1v2. Hopefully, it's not like the last one where I messed it up. I should be able to get him out there. Yes, it is going here with the ultimate. At least I did some damage. I'm going to kind of try to hide around the pendulum a little bit if possible right here. Okay, so going to throw the fireball. Dodge out. Do not want to get hit with that fair because that could have been GG for me right there. She's at 96% vulnerability. I'm at 83. I would love for Penny to take my side right now and eliminate him coming in with the dispersion. I didn't turn it around into the air light air heavy combo mainly because I was unsure if I would have actually landed it. I probably could have actually going to throw my fireball here. Go on the other side dodging through perfect right here. Use the full three could counter it. Oh nice little dodge dodging forward turning around with the blast into the dodge from the Izanami but could not avoid that beautiful air combo there knocking them out bringing a second point to my team. I'm feeling very powerful as all right now. I think I'm going to keep going after this Saul is just so good as I was saying my Saul guides coming up soon and it's just all the tips and tricks I've learned with her now again I'm not the best Saul player however she's one of those characters I just thoroughly enjoy oh wait 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 what happened to my partner he just fell all the way down but as I was saying I just thoroughly enjoy Saul and you're gonna see it here I'm gonna try my best to turn this around I'm very low vulnerability I might be able to do it and I'm trying to stay in the sky as much as possible using that counter on the fire part on the Thanatos hopefully holding it a little longer dropping it can it eliminate no he's getting bounced around in the wrong directions which keeping the Thanatos alive I do have dispersion I know is Anami's in this probably let's do it quickly no okay gonna try another thing here hit him with the air heavy and we clash can i get it boom oh that was perfect i'm gonna turn that little scene into a little short that was actually really nice right there dodging through hitting in with some nice light attacks right there i need to avoid that penny like she was about to turn on to me as you can see i threw the fire the moment she passed her ultimate she's gonna come with the invis and did not get hit with my fire fart but she did collect the health orb very smart and as you can see i turned away because i expected the sight that was, in my opinion, the smartest move. Going to charge forward, dodging forward right there. That's one of the tips when you're going up against Izanami. 
every time you dodge towards, you more or less have a chance of being hit by it. So you dodge away or just move away if possible so you can save your dodge. That actually looks nice. I could probably get him, but my ultimate, no. Oh, that was so good that she had her mobility up, saving her up. And I come in there with the air heavy. That actually did not mean to hit her. Is she going to fall? GG. Man, Saul is really too hot to handle sometimes.